Hi guys, so you might have noticed a bit of a different background kind of thing going on here. I have basically had my room decorated. Yay, it's not that different, but I'm going to do a room tour because I have never done one before. I haven't done a properly edited vloggy style video in a very long time and I enjoy these, so here it goes. Okay, let's start with the obvious new wall. My bookcase used to be here. I've moved my bed over here. Here is like... <laughs> the biggest teddy ever. I think I might count all the things that are slightly fox-like in my room also. There's my guitar just kind of on the floor at the moment next to my keyboard. Here is my um, unfortunately messy drawer full of like letters and college work. Foxy! Foxy! My posters are here at the moment because at the moment I don't want to ruin this like beautiful white wall. Here, hello, is where I take all my MySpace photos and this is Door, or door, I'm not sure how to say that word. And this is my new spirit hood, which I love and I think I'm gonna wear him for the rest of the video, actually. Him, I mean, I don't know why I called it him. All right, let's get to the stuff that's not extremely obvious and boring, hopefully. DVD collection. So here is basically Grease, The Dark Knight, Buffy the Vampire Slayer, The Scream, all the films that are quite good, but I don't watch that often. Here, the Michael Garoman's tour style DVD kind of things. Uh, here is Jim Carrey and Disney films because they're like the best. Anything with Jim Carrey in or made by Disney has got a good chance of being a really, really good film. Liar Liar, Yes Man, Ace Ventura, which is basically the film that like brought me up <laughs> in a way because I watched it like every day, all day. The Truman Show, it's amazing. If you haven't seen it yet, it's honestly like amazing. A series of unfortunate events, The Grinch, Bruce Almighty, Alice in Wonderland, The Nightmare Before Christmas, and The Fox and the Hound. I suppose that's my fourth foxy thing of the day. Here's some of my other favourites right now. This is the Green Day box set thing. Yay! So I've got Uno, first CD, and the rest of them are waiting. Hunger Games, Scott Pilgrim, Back to the Future, Lord of the Rings, and Harry Potter. Yay! So many good films. CD collection and stuff. Okay, first of all, me in tiny little Lego form, kind of, with a sword. I really wanted a bow and arrow. World of Warcraft cards, which I don't know how to play, but I like the look of. Here is my little penny collection. CD collection. I'm not going to show you all of the CDs for obvious reasons. Yeah, best if I just sit down. <laughs> um, this is my Green Day, My Chemical Romance, Fall Out Boy, Panic one because they're like my four favourites ever. At one point I'm pretty sure I only bought their CDs. On top here, there's no room left in these. Marina and the Diamonds, Pierce the Veil, Foxborough Hot Tubs aka Green Day and Paramore. In this one is my second favourite so let's have a look at what I seem to class as second favourites at the moment. Never Short Never, Gym Class Heroes, Katy Perry and Lady Gaga. <laughs> David Bowie, Billy Idol, More Paramore, Sleeping With Sirens, Breathe Carolina, Avenged Sevenfold, 303. Um, Nirvana, Pierce the Veil, again, did I already say that? I'm not sure. Michael Jackson, and there's a Prodigy CD in there, which I just don't listen to anymore. This one is just random CDs, and this one is just random CDs as well, because I've kind of lost complete track at the moment. This is now where I keep my books. I've gotten rid of a lot of the old ones and kind of kept the ones that I think I'm actually going to read or have read and that were really good. Mockingjay, Darren Shan, and Lord of the Rings and The Hobbit is basically all that's in there because I'm currently reading The Mockingjay still because I kind of have no time to read at the moment, but I'll have read it eventually. Well, that's kind of my lyric book. All my stuff that I write in is in here. There's some Disney books at the back. There's Mike and Mucka Romance and just random other books and some pencils at the back there as well. These are probably the cutest books in existence and probably three of my favorite Disney movies ever other than The Lion King. My scrapbook. So on top here, Green Day ticket. Um, Pirates of the Caribbean squashed coin thing that I got in Los Angeles. Um, Frank A. Euro's guitar pick. Let's have a look inside. No. First page, Fall Out Boy tickets. Um, Avenged Sevenfold, Gym Class Heroes, cinema tickets. Another Fall Out Boy little wristband thing here. Kerrang Tour, 303 gig, Alice in Wonderland, Youth in Revolt, Scott Pilgrim. I'm guessing Michael Cera was busy that year. Another Green Day ticket. Scream ticket, Bring Me the Horizon. 
Breathe Carolina, yay! Bless the Fall, I didn't actually watch Bless the Fall. I'm not, they're not bad or anything, I just didn't really know the music at the time. I went to see Pierce the Veil. Um, Taking Back Sunday, Panic at the Disco, Alton Towers, and where else? Oh, a Metro ticket from Santa Monica. That's the end of my scrapbook at the moment, apparently. The rest of this bottom drawer, um, Harry Potter, Lemony Snickets, I can't really point. <laughs> <laughs> that works. Harry Potter, Lemony Snickets, Narnia, um, a bit of Goosebumps and a Buffy the Vampire Slayer book in there also. Yay. Phil would approve. And this, if you were wondering, is my version of a box of pink fluffy secrets. Here, lots of Lush products which smell amazing. I wish you could like smell through here. Hats and tail. <laughs> um, more Lush products. That's to try and cover my eye bags. It's doing such a good job. So good. Here is my hair dye which makes me cry every time I look at it because I can't dye my hair anymore because I've got a job. Here is a Boss um, guitar pedal which I still haven't learned how to use but I will one day because I want it so I don't want to let it go to waste. Here is my stuff I use for recording. Lots of wires, basically. And here is where some of my shoes go. So that's my room tour video. I'm probably gonna upload a couple more videos this week because I didn't have time to learn a cover, but I do have some videos recorded that I just need to edit. And some of them, I think, are a bit more important than others. So some will go on my side channel and some will go on my main channel. I'm sorry if you don't like these kind of vloggy videos, but I just kind of want to make sure that I'm still making these videos because I enjoy them and also YouTube and music are like my favourite things. So I want to make sure I make like normal YouTube videos as well as music videos. And in case you're wondering the progress with my album, I've wrote half of the album so far. Two of the songs, or maybe three, you might have heard if you've been watching my live shows because I've given like little samples on the third song. So I need to write the next four and I'm gonna start recording next week, I think. But I don't have much time and neither do the people helping me out, so I'm gonna start recording next week and it'll probably take a couple of months at least. All my links are in the description if you'd like to come and say hello anytime, I would really appreciate it. I love talking to you guys. So that's basically it and um, I will see you guys as soon as possible. Keep your feet on the ground. Bye.